call me Desi. I'm from Lampung, Sumatra, Indonesia. Hi, I'm Chandrika Citrasari. People can call me Chandrika or Ichan. I'm an Indonesian language assistant from Malang, East Java, Indonesia. Hi everyone, my name is Dave Andreu Marcelo Latuni, but you can call me Dave. I'm from Ambon, Maluku, eastern part of Indonesia. Hi everyone, nama saya Yahya Zakaria, and you can also call me Zaki. Saya dari Jakarta, Indonesia. Australians that Indonesia is not only about Bali or Jakarta or Sumatra but also from the eastern part of Indonesia. Back home in Indonesia I used to teach Indonesian for foreign students and I really want to try to introduce Indonesian and teach Indonesian language in a place where Indonesian language is not spoken as the first language. Besides I really want to experience living in an English-speaking country's culture and I also would like to go around Western Australia. I am really proud of being who I really am as an Indonesian and therefore I would really love to promote my culture and my language overseas worldwide. This is the opportunity. So that's why I am here as an Indonesian language assistant. I like education and I want to capturize the difference of education in Indonesia and Australia and I would like to take benefits for both countries by being a language assistant. Since I am part of the program, I've learned so much. Also because I'm attending some of the professional development and how to redefine your classroom management and how to integrate technology in the process of learning. Being a year as a language assistant, I learned a lot of positive things. One of my favorite things is how the teacher here teaches me how to give a positive compliment to students' work in order to, in order to encourage them to work harder. During the program, I've already achieved so many things, including to sharpen my skill to be the role model for the students. Also, I learned so many things in order to manage the classroom from the mental teachers. Uh, I do realize that I get a lot of opportunities from this program and because of these programs I got a chance to improve my English and besides that I also have an opportunity to learn from my mentor teacher about classroom management. There are many memorable things that happened during the program and one of the things that I cannot forget is in one of the high school we have a cultural club and I run that cultural club with my mentor teacher and I really appreciate how the students are willing to giving up their lunch time in order to learn about Indonesian culture and beside that I also have a dancing club in one of the primary school the students doing really well one day we have a school production and I was teaching them a song which is so hit in my era which is 90s about Australian and it teaches how Aboriginal as a native people of Australia and I feel so related to bring that song to the school concert one of the very successful moment and yet memorable when we're actually doing some cooking demonstration I was making martabak and the teacher and I worked together to integrate the content learning the CLIL method into the lesson it works perfectly they learn and amazed in how these are actually working we combine science and language at the same time it was superb the most unforgettable moment for me is when I'm trying to rap in front of the class in front of students and they just wondering that Indonesia can also do rap. This program has changed me completely. I have gained so much network, information, as well as exploring Western part of Australia. Now, I really hope, I hope, I hope, I hope they that the next candidate would bring such a new color about Indonesia to our Australian kids to make the students 
love Indonesian and Indonesian language. And also can maintain the good relationship between the two countries, Australia and Indonesia, especially in the education system. Saya Zeki. Saya Chandrika. Saya Desi. Saya Dave. We are the Indonesian Language Assistant 2000!